Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Madden Ultimate Team gameplay. In this gameplay, we are going to be playing a $25 money game versus Young Salty. Come here. I, you might have to make a read. I know you're shaking over there. I want to read option as much as possible. But is, you might have is to Henry make one. shaking? And in this game, we are going to be obviously playing for $25, all Madden Mutt. But besides that, we're going to be testing out Golden Ticket Taysom Hill for the first time ever and here we go boys here's the team uh let me maximize my ap real quickly and i don't know what i want to use whether it be two edge protectors or one you know uh post up one mid and elite uh give me one second boys and boys it's been a minute since i've done a live com uh where i'm playing and breaking down the game and you know this is the first time i've done it in a minute while playing for kind of like a good amount of money 25 dollars. you know it's a pretty good amount it could add up if he wants to keep playing and playing and playing Obviously, hopefully we win this game. And here are the abilities, boys. So we're gonna be using short and elite on George Kittle, and we use playmaker on Moss, and then on Taysom Hill. We are gonna be using escape Arter, escape artist, hot round master, and slinger. Mid short and elite, and then I'm gonna put mid and elite and run two tight ends with Vernon Davis. And for the card itself, you haven't seen the stats. Um, it is a scrambler times two field general times one strong arm times one improvisers times one he has 98 speed he's six foot two 99 throw power i believe his release is really good and he has 88 strength 72 catching i mean he is a tight end he, he could do it all it's Taysom hill if you don't watch the nfl i mean then i don't know what to tell you but if you do you obviously know about Taysom hill maybe the drew Brees replacement but that's for another video for another time not really my forte i'm looking for his carrying he has 96 break tackle. I mean, this card could really do it all. Um, if you run one of those quarterback run schemes, this card is for you. And there it is, 96 carrying. And on defense, boys, we are gonna be rocking uh, two lurkers. We are gonna be running Giants defense. See right here, lurker number one and lurker number two. Acrobats, mid zone KOs, and one mid zone KO on DK, and Reg Ricky Jackson, um, Jason Owa, and then there's another dude, Montez Sweat. We'll have El Toros. Now playbooks real quick, boys. And then we are going to hop into the game. Seahawks, Giants, Raiders uniforms. Let's get this money, boys. And boys, if you don't know who Salty is, he's the Eagles club series runner-up. He played my guy, Henry. He gave him a good fight, a good play, I mean, a good game. Uh, but ultimately, he lost. I mean, that was still his first time on the main stage. He's a young and upcoming player. I feel like I've been just playing all these young goons. And here's no other... Uh, another money game versus a young goon. I let him get host because it is like a West Coast, East Coast thing. And there he goes. He has Taysom Hill himself. Um, maybe he might be able to run a little 146, but we'll see. Definitely for your boy, we're going to be rocking out that 146 on those crucial third and fourth downs. And just how I like it, we're going to be getting the ball out of half. Defense first. And it's been a minute since I played a money game. I definitely try to play some money games. Um, I'm going to definitely stream some when I get some more. But, you know, this is nice. A little cool down $25 game. I've been playing a little bit of regs, so you know, I gotta get used to mutt, and if that's how it goes. You play mutt, you play regs, you gotta get used to each other mode. But let's set up our depth chart, man. Substitutions. Montez Sweat is gonna play DT. He is insane. He gets A gaps. Ricky Jackson already in the same spot. And there goes Jason Owa. We're gonna be using Taylor Mays. Mike Evans has to go in the slot, boys. He is too tall not to play him anywhere else. And then I do believe I have Nambi right here, Jalen Ramsey, DK Metcalf, and there goes Sean Taylor, who I could potentially use her as well. But we're going to start off the game with no zone drops. And man, oh man, it's been a minute. Um, I'm not going to lie. It seems to me like it's right here. We almost use a rush on the first play. It seems to me like Taysom Hill looks like Michael Vick. I, I don't know what it is, but he just looks like Michael Vick to me. We're going to run a little bit of match. And you guys couldn't tell. It's right there. We almost use a rush him. Uh... Salty is running the as he flips. Sorry, it's gonna take a minute, boys. He is running uh, with T Taysom Hill. He is running Carolina Bunch, and it's been a minute since I played that. And there goes Montez Sweat with the A cap. <laughs> this dude is a cheat code. If you have enough coins, I really don't know how many coins he is. Um, go get him. That's all I gotta say. Go get him. He is a walking A gap. He is insane, and we're just gonna run one four six here. Expect a run, guys. As you know, Carolina Bunch, it has that audible to, uh, as he's going to audible it to right here. There's two tight end set, and it's pretty good. I'm on Rod Woodson stuck. 
um this isn't gonna be the best right here i kind of got messed up but you know we have a spy out here and we're might able to get a pick but we'll take it he kind of forced a crosser read uh you guys see that so often a little rollout crosser and you know not a bad play call i think he had the in route more open though but nonetheless we will take it um we're gonna get the ball in great field position and boys like i just said man if i'm not talking or if i'm messing up my words it's because i'm not trying to lose 25 dollars boys uh 25 dollars that is a good amount of money and it adds up man like if he wants to re again uh definitely want to win that first game but here we go with the audibles we are gonna put z spot and then blood as our audibles and i do have vernon davis so we're gonna have to put him i'm gonna pause the game real quick boys basically boys i put vernon davis at the second receiver spot um so he has that mid and elite um it's pretty much the same thing as short and elite i probably should have put vernon slot receiver but it's it's all good it's right here we are gonna come out probably in z spot first play and the thing is i don't have protected on and i also he's in a unique defense boys i also do not have what's it called any type of edge protectors or anything like that is right here we're gonna just motion out and there goes Mike Evans running that Z spot fast. And Taysom Hill kind of has a nice release, boys. I mean, it's qu quick to judge. That was super wide open. But, hey, that was a great, you know, release. Great catch and throw. I thought I was going to get screamed at. Honestly, I don't think there was, the pressure even got there. Um, he's running this 2-4-5 odd defense, I want to say. And if you guys watched competitive Madden really, really closely, you saw that Fancy ran this as right here. Tough scene. Can't, Lake and Tomlinson, man, I swear he never blocks for me and got a sub in Zeke. But if you watch the Madden Bowl finals, Fancy actually decided to run this versus Wesley Curry. And uh, it, to say the least, it did not go to plan. Uh, he got gashed. He got absolutely toted on. It's right here. I'm just going to hit Vernon Davis right there, and he's going to fall forward. That's why you like to have those big body guys. Not only could you run like uh, 2 1 2 sets and avoid 1 4 6. But you also have the chance to, uh, you know, audible to something like this. And obviously, he's just a bigger frame. And we're going to run a little bit of inside zone right here. Like, look at this set. D-line is spread. Like, boys, I am I think I should be able to run inside zone for days on this. And there goes Zeke getting eight yards. And trust me, boys, if you know how I play, you know I will spam the run if you can't stop it. Um, and right here, we are going to just kind of freestyle, boys. Hopefully, 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 hopefully we get good time. Um I'm gonna block our tight end but look for vernon davis here boys look for vernon davis and that might be a dot and that's a dot crazy dot crazy freestyle boys uh i saw him creeping up with his user and i'm like hold up bro i have this specific play out of a uh, two tight end set with a real fade and an inside seam that play is really good with hot round master boys and that combo i just ran i i uh, suggest you run it we're looking good right now we're back on defense we get ball at half and you know it's always beautiful when you're cooking up some freestyle dots right here boys once more back in the 55 wide defense and we're just trying to shed man we're just trying to shed let our el toros go to work and you know if we're gonna have to adjust we will adjust trust me boys it's right here pretty good user and there goes sean taylor making a nice tackle surprise the blitz didn't come in but you know we're all good we're gonna probably run a little bit of zone drop defense right here 25s 10s and 5s let me know what you guys think about this defense. And we're going to baseline press it as well. Uh, shout out to Spammin for this one. As I, I've seen him run this. He even ran it versus me. This defense is pretty annoying to play against. It's right here. He's going to roll out. And great playmaker. I should have checked if he had playmaker or not. And sheesh, that's a lot of yards. I'm not going to lie. That kind of hurts because, you know, we we've been playing pretty good defense. But, you know, we will take it, man. Trust me, we will take it. It's right here. We're going to go back and run a little bit of match. And I got to check his abilities. I think he might have QB Playmaker on, honestly, boys. Because uh, with Taysom, you do get... What's it called? Uh, it's right here. I get quick hike. You get... What's it called? It's right here. Another good dot. I wanted to third that guy, but it's all good. You get QB Playmaker for 7 or 10 or whatever it is. Because he has an improviser slot. And right here, we know he doesn't have the best run. So we are going to kind of just sell out to the run. Um... Defense is looking a little weird. Sean Taylor can't get out there. He's going to score a touchdown. That was actually pretty good defense, boys. But it's all good. We're going to have to rebuttal and get seven. And that was a very fast drive, honestly. I got to play better defense. 
Man, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's super hard doing this. I don't know how I did it last year. I don't think I really played a live comp sweaty or a money game. I think more for the most part, they're like weekend league games or head to heads, but it's pretty tough to do a live comp, man. Uh, if you see someone doing live comps, give them their respect because this is no easy task, especially when you're playing you know, a pretty good game, a pretty good opponent is right here. We're just gonna run a little bit of base. I told you about that base, boys. Someone's running this defense. I don't know how good it is, to be honest. Um, but I think it does scream. If someone's running this defense, just pop a base and, you know, make them regret running it. It's right here. We're going to go back to the same play. Play worked really well last time. He ran cover three hard flats. And this time, it's a wide open Mike Evans. And, you know, we'll take it, man. We're going to let this go to the second quarter. And we'll see what he gives us this upcoming quarter and for the rest of the game. I'm kind of hesitant to pass, boys. If you haven't been able to tell, like... I don't know, I'm just a little nervous uh, if I'm gonna get screamed at or not, because it has been a minute since, you know, I played a, any types of Madden is right here. George Kittle wide open, just gonna secure my catch and fall to the ground. And honestly, boys, he is not screaming. That's a really good, good sign. And I think I have Omaha, boys. I don't know what I put on. It's Bazooka, okay, so someone was on my account, if you guys couldn't tell. And here's a nice freestyle dot. Hopefully we get some time in the pocket. And we have Rod Woodson at the user once more. And he is getting really, really aggressive with that user. I may have been able to throw that streak, boys. But, hey, we'll take our drag. We'll take our drag. We'll take our drag. And it seems to me like he doesn't know how to defend the freestyle formations. Um, it's been really easy pickings for me so far. He's right here, great user. Great uh, gap shoot. Going once more back to this little uh, whatever you want to call it. Two seam play. I'm looking for the seams once more. And boom, Randy Moss. I wish I could have caught, caught a block, but we're fine. We are going to get it to the five-yard line. And boys, honestly, probably shouldn't be in two tight end set or gun set right here. I should probably be in like strong wing. I expect a run commit right here. And he doesn't run commit, but we do get hit stick to the five still. So we don't lose any yards, basically. And we're going to hop in the strong wing. And it gets tough, honestly, boys, to score down here, especially in Mutt. You don't have Devontae Adams. I'm going to go on balance real quick. And he's still in the same defense, boys. So, I mean, I don't think this is a good run defense. I don't have Zeke in the game, unfortunately. But let's see what we could do. And he freaking blows it up somehow. Um, we're going to go back into the gun because it's just not there, boys. Uh, we're going to try to cook something up, whether it be in a two tight end set or a normal set. Trust me, boys. I think I could cook something up. And I don't know, boys. Let's just try to freestyle something. Uh, this looks cool. See right here, we are gonna highball that. And what a dot, nice freestyle, man. I'm freestyling on the, on the fly. It's a great feeling. Um, that was honestly, he's a very sleepy user, very sleepy coverage. Just a nice highball dot, and man, this two tight end set is pretty nice. All right, if we get a stop here, boys, we are gonna definitely win this game because any types of points before half, plus the ball at a half, we're basically just dead this game. Here we go, boys. We are going to run a little bit of cover two to the right, left side. And we are sending the dogs. And, of course, he's going to flip. Um, but we're going to be all right because we get our adjustments barely down. I actually manned up the tight end, as crazy as that seems. He just didn't go out there, but it's all good. I like those adjustments. I'm going to run them again. And there goes the flip once more. And here we go. I couldn't show you the result of the play art, but it's all good. And we could have got crazy with the user. Um, he kind of got cheated, honestly. The El Toros went insane. But I definitely could have picked that off if I maybe had Acrobat. I don't know, boys. What do you think about that? That's right here. We are going to run a little bit of match. And there we go. We finally get our adjustments set up for once. And Mike Evans with Acrobat goes crazy. That's why you put him in the slot, boys. Six foot five. I'm pretty hyped about that. I'm not going to lie, boys, because it just makes it that much more closer to ending this game. Um, I ran match right there. I, he does have QB Playmaker to answer your guys' questions. And boom, what do we see now? We see a little bit of, a little bit of uh, whatever this is, uh, mid blitz. There we go. I haven't played this in a minute. And unfortunately for us, we don't have a super fast guy out there. But it doesn't matter. Wide open bombs. Vernon Davis to the Baja, Mike Evans pressed up, 98 speed versus 98 speed, and that's that little inverted seam streak. He didn't shade up for whatever reason, but 
I don't know, man. I don't know. I'll take the free touchdowns. That's the best feeling in the world. Once more, we're going to be running. We're going to run cover two right here, boys. It's going to come out on cover two. We're going to man up the slot. And boom, this is just a simple cover two. We are going to go user the right side if he does want to take off. Just got to watch out for that playmaker. It's right here. He's just going to dump it down to the flat. And I mean, that definitely did not look like it was going to get 10 yards, 9 yards. But it honestly did somehow. And we're going to run the same defense again. This time, though, I'm going to man up the tight end because this tight end has been bugging me all game long. He's going to flip, of course, but it's all good. We're here with the adjustments, and hopefully we get a shed, boys. That's what it's about at this point of the game, and oh, I did not think he was going to throw that. Somehow, that's a completion. Just make a tackle, man. Uh, I, he got a lot of time, honestly, and I was clicked on a Ramsey. I thought he was going to throw like underneath, but honestly, I've seen a lot of tendencies right now. He's playing a little wild. He likes the long plays, the long developing plays, and Right here, one, another long developing play, but Jason Owa is there. And I don't know if you guys saw that click on. That was a pretty good click on, in my opinion. But we are good. We are going to send the dogs right here and hope for the best. When I say send the dogs, I mean send six. We're going to get in that hover spot. Take away everything. And boom, another crazy user. And here we are going to do what we're going to do here. Sorry if I can't talk. It's a little rough. Is We're going to hop in 146, man. And we might run man, honestly, but for the most part, probably just going to run zone. So we're going to keep our flats at default. I wanted to run man, but hey, I, I, I personally don't think he could pick it up. And let's see what he does. Um, we've got a setup set up. <laughs> and we're going to protect the sticks. And boom. Send pressure right at him. And boys, if you watch the uh, Salty versus Henry game, you saw that Henry... Henry was sending the 146 at him, and Salty did not know what to do. 146, a lot of people don't know how to pick it up or play against it. And I just know this from watching Madden, man. If you watch Madden, you'll know, oh, I'm playing someone in Weekend League. I saw him last week play, uh, I don't know, Throne or uh, Civil, and Civil was running this, and he couldn't beat it. Let me run that a little bit, mix it up, and you'll see the results. Right here, boys, I just don't want to mess up, man. We've been playing flawless. I'm talking about flawless football for the first half. If we mess this up, that kind of just take away everything we just did. Um, boom. Taysom Hill is a god. I should maybe throw on a throwing ability, boys. I don't know if he gets inside dead eye, but I think he does get roaming dead eye. And I, I don't know if this is accurate, but I think we are like, like we haven't thrown an incompletion with this guy yet, boys. I think it's been to that point yet. It's right here. We're going to run. Another playmaker play, and boom, Taysom Hill, another dot. We caught it this time, and 11 for 11. I know you guys see it, screenshot it, do whatever you got to do. Taysom Hill football, baby. It's right here. We kind of messed up, but boom, another easy out route. We're going to get out of bounds, and that no huddle is on our side, boys. I kind of I kind of have to keep this a, a complete game, boys. I'm not going to lie. I'm, I'll take a sack. I'll run the ball. I'm trying to keep this uh, perfect this perfect game keep on going. It's basically like MLB The Show or MLB. Um, I don't know how often that happens where... I got one more play, boys. I don't know how often this, this happens where you just... What's it called? I, I couldn't talk, boys. I was in a crucial situ situation. I almost messed up and didn't get three, three. But I don't know how often this happens in the NFL where you don't throw incompletion. Um, and sorry if I'm stuttering boys trust me. I know it's not clean, but it's been a minute. It's been a minute uh, All I know I could say is that when I give you this in-depth analysis, it'll be clean But during the play it might be a little choppy as you see but 28 to 10 we get ball at half It's looking like a wraps boys um, We're gonna I'm gonna transition it to the second half real quick Boys second half is among us. We are just gonna run the ball a little bit. Owen trap in the audibles um Maybe a little bit of read option. This is a Taysom Hill gameplay. I am on conservative. So, yeah, we're going to run some read options. See what we could do with Taysom Hill. But like I was saying earlier, man, the number seven really resembles Vic, boys. I know uh, they're different skin colors and all that. But I'm telling you, boys, uh, they are. They look like kind of similar when you're in that backfield. You see number seven. You're like, hold up. Do I got Vic? And I'm pretty sure Taysom Hill is a lefty. Like, it, I think it, both, it goes both ways. Is he lefty, boys? I, I might be completely tripping on that one. Um... 
let's see right here this is the only way to tell if he's a lefty or not we're just gonna throw a dot see if he's a lefty and no he is a righty okay i was completely wrong about that and we almost throw a book but we throw a dot gotta get crazy with Verna. gotta get crazy with Verna. go 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 oh i'm not gonna lie i'm having a lot of fun boys i wish i could have scored right there but the perfect game is still alive it's still alive boys and i'm not gonna lie i i, I i'm messing up a lot i thought Taysom hill was a lefty and uh man oh man it's right here he he must have known he put his option defense on whatever it is to guard the quarterback and he's tired let me chill you see Taysom hill is dark blue that's the most fatigue you could get and you see in a little bit a couple seconds he's gonna go down a tick and fatigue honestly might just have to run the ball and that's what we're gonna do as right as right here we're just gonna run um base and how often do you guys see people running mid blitz still man it's almost june and people are still in mid blitz uh that just shows you man that like mid blitz was super popping earlier as you see right here quarterback is red and th that just shows you also like how long of a year it's been of madden people used to spam mid blitz man coverage some people didn't even shade up that's how good man coverage was and i'm not gonna lie mid blitz was pretty annoying to play against who would have known mid blitz would have been like that and we're gonna go for this boys hopefully Taysom has fatigue on and honestly we're just gonna we're gonna fake a field goal we're gonna fake a field goal because why not i'm thinking i'm trying to think if i want to run or if i want to throw a pass <sighs> this is gonna be tough this is gonna be a little tough we're gonna run the blast and of course he is in a defense to guard it um i don't know boys i really don't know we're just gonna kick the field goal man i'm not trying to meme him i think he's streaming right now and yeah there we go going up 21 second half is pretty much wraps boys it's right here boys we're gonna just run zone drop defense and that might be the it for this game uh shout out to spamming again for this defense this defense is pretty crazy you send two you put your 25s and your 10s out there you baseline press you're gonna give up flat routes trust me but you know you only give them up for five yards this is definitely a safe defense that you want to run like if you're just trying to make them dink and dunk up the weight up the field this is what you want to run boys is right here we barely get our adjustments off, but same thing. That vert hook is going to go crazy for us. And you could also mix it up right here. I thought he had QB playmaker, but I, th I guess he doesn't because he didn't get a real playmaker on that guy. And I'm going to finally check his abilities after all this time. And let's see what he has. Short and elite, elite, short and elite playmaker, gunslinger, hot remaster, escape. This is the average abilities that you see right here. He gets cheated, boys, and this is gonna be it. If we get this stop, I'm sure he's gonna quit out. And they cheat. They did something very funny, boys. They, uh, you know how sometimes it's a fourth down. It'll say ass Madden. They made him want to punt it. Made him waste the timeout. Pretty much just like GGs at this point. Um, I'm gonna man up the tight end because why not? You know, why not man up the tight end? Right here, he's gonna playmaker, and he was throwing a pick, boys. Pretty crazy user. And that's gonna be it, boys. Uh, I'll cut to the end when he quits out, but for now, I really ain't, I don't got nothing to say. Maybe show you the final stat line as well, but we're going to run the ball. We're not even going to run it up. It's just respect for my peer. Boys, I just threw a pick six on something super tragic. Um, it wasn't the best read or nothing, but what I was chewing clock. I thought I came out in the wrong play and I already had chew clock on. I wasn't going to call timeout. We end up throwing a pick six, and there goes the incompletion streak. I think we were like 15 to 15, 14 to 14. Nonetheless, I mean, it's all good. I don't think he could still win because this game is definitely out of reach. Um, but he's only down by 14 now compared to 21. And look at the yards comparison. Definitely just dominated this game so far. I mean, it doesn't really matter. It's June Madden. Just some content for you boys. And there goes Zeke. I had a pretty crazy play with him. Let's see if he could crib this. And no, you're down to the 15. Look at those stats. He's going to do the little feed Zeke. Wow, they cheated him on that celebration. Boys, I'm still here. I don't know why I'm in this game. Um, but boys, Salty needs to learn how to quit. He could already be on the game two right by now. He's right here. He's going to dot up. Get to the one. But there's just no time left. And I'm not going to be that type of guy. Maybe he's just trying to get better, you know? But I mean... I don't know. There goes Montez Sweat again. And we're just going to run man right here. He's right here. Montez Sweat. I'm trying to get a pick. He was throwing a pick to Montez Sweat. 
<laughs> he was throwing a pick to Montez Sweat, boys. Trust me, I seen it, boys. That's, I mean, I, I got no con. I got nothing for you. I got nothing for you at this time of moment. And there goes DK somehow dropping interception. I don't know how a wide receiver drops that, but hey, EA Sports is in the game. Right here, I am the QB spy. I am the QB spy. And somehow he just throws a dot. Crazy dot. GG's in the chat.